Hello, we are here in Athens. We are the city center behind me is the Greek parliament. And it's May, it's really hot, the sun is burning. Uh, it's gonna be the start of our tour. We're gonna show you many Greek uh, tourist attractions. And I hope you enjoy the video. So let's start. Street. It's the most central street in Athens. It's the busiest shopping street in Athens and it's in the city center and you can find every shopping chain you want uh, here. It's very uh, busy uh, at rush hour but be careful here because there are many pickpockets but other than that it's really safe. This is St. Irene Square uh, and here you can find the best cafes and restaurants to have Greek uh, food. Uh, it's really one of my favorite spots because it's really calm and it's uh, right next to our new street which is like really busy and you can do your shopping and then you can have some something to drink or eat. We are at the Roman Forum, uh, it's uh, right below the Acropolis. It's a must see in Athens, if you have only like one day to visit Athens, this is the area to, uh, to look for. Um, where got, there are like most beautiful houses uh, around and it's, uh, it's really like it's out of this world. So follow me and we'll see a better, we'll have a better view. Raphael, did you like this area? Oh, excellent, marvelous, absolutely fabulous. Can I add superb? <laughs> you can add superb. If you have the time, you should definitely roam those streets. There are the most amazing uh, architecture and the houses are amazing. And now Plaka. Excellent, marvelous. Fabulous! <laughs> After a few minutes of walking, we arrived at the Acropolis Museum and look what I got for you. The Parthenon. I'm here too. <laughs> Ta-da! Ta this is 
the Odeon of Herodes Atticus. If you are Italian, you have the chance to uh, to watch one uh, opera or a concert. Don't miss it. It's like one of a lifetime experience. Now we're on the way to something very, very magical. Can you think of a better place to rest other than that? I don't think so. By the way, this is called Pnyx. Walking your way down the Acropolis Hill, you'll find yourself at the CEO. It's an area where you can have a bike or a cafe, and it's really graphic. Uh, but at that point, it can be very bustling, so it's not uh, for everyone. This is the Monastiraki Square. It's a very popular meeting point. It's the beginning of the flea market, uh, but be very careful because uh, there are many pickpockets here and they might deceive you and uh, steal your things, so be very cautious. Here you're gonna find anything, I mean anything you want, and it's in very good prices. This behind me is the National Gallery. It was recently renovated and opened to the public uh, to commemorate the 200 years of the Greek Revelation. Um, there are many artifacts in there, including El Greco paintings and Picasso and Caravaggio and Rembrandt, but it was most notorious when a, a Picasso painting called The Woman's Head was stolen in 2012. I hope after the renovation it's safer now. This is the Panathinaik Stadium. Uh, it was the place where the Panathinaik Games took place in the ancient times, but not the Olympic Games. Uh, after a few years of abandonment, uh, it, the place was uh, actually uh, almost ruined. What you see right now is a reconstruction uh, that was made in order to host the first modern Olympic Games in 1896.
National Archaeological Museum in Athens. It is one of the most important uh, museums in the world. It has many artifacts from uh, the Greek era or from the prehistoric and ancient era. And uh, it's a must-see if you come to Athens. Omonia used to be the center of Athens 50 years ago. It was where everything was happening. But since uh, then it has taken quite a downfall. But hopefully with the new fountain that is trying to reimagine the old uh, Omonia Square, hopefully it's going to get better. Our last stop is the National Gardens. It's the best park in the city center and you can have here to take a breath, relax and enjoy your evening. Here you can also find some animals and birds and uh, if you have children it's really fun. Please subscribe to the channel and like, share and comment on this video. Enjoy!